select a twin. Um, this guy looks sick. Let's go for him. Or oh, enter my name. Okay. Um, don't worry. I'll, I'll change the thing on the side in a second. Actually, I'll do it now. There we go. There. This guy is gonna be my bad man, G. Just like that, a god took away my sister. Some kind of seal was cast upon me, and I lost my power. So while we used to travel from world to world, we are now trapped here. Wow, uh, <laughs> off to a great start. Um, jumped straight into action as soon as my stream side. I didn't know it would have started so suddenly. Um, yeah, but welcome to Genshin Impact, it's a new RPG game that uh, literally just came out, like, last week or so, I think. Um, decided to jump on a trend because I kind of like RPG games a lot. Okay, I'm going to be How playing How many case. years ago was it? I don't know. But I intend to find out. When I woke, I was all alone, until I met you two months ago. Yeah, Paimon really owes you for that. Otherwise, Paimon likely would have drowned. So Paimon will do her best to be a great guy. So I'm guessing Paimon's her name. We should head off. Let's get going. Well, first of all, graphics look amazing. Oh, okay, R wants to spin. That's really weird. I'm guessing that's my stamina. Okay, it spins a toggle. Calm. It is. It's my sword. The path ends here. Guess we'll just have to climb. Climbing depletes stamina, and depleted stamina takes time to recover. Okay, let's take the route we planned. We're off to. Which of the seven are you looking for exactly? Let's go see over here. Come on, be something over here. Okay, I'm, I'm finna about to drown. I just drowned. I've already died. <laughs> I've already died. Oh my god. in these fruits replenish my health maybe That's a statue 
statue of the Seven. There are a few of these statues scattered across the land to show the Seven's protection over the world. Among the Seven Gods, this god controls the wind. Paimon's not sure whether the god you're looking for is the animal god, but... Paimon will take you to the animal god's place first, and there's a reason why. Why does that voice have to sound very, very familiar? As we Swear all know, poetry and language flow like before. the wind. There'll definitely be someone there who knows about your sister. At least that's what Paimon thinks. Whether the gods actually answer you is a different story. You never know unless you try. So let's hop to it. Okay, I think from that prompt there, I can press R3 to quickly grab every item in the area. Oh wow, so I just got a map. Sick. So I'm at Starfell Lake right now, and that looks like some civilization. Okay. Oh, did you just feel the elements of the world? Seems all you had to do was just touch the statue and you got the power of animal. As much as they may want it, people in this world can never get a hold of powers as easily as you. Uh-huh. It's because you're not from this world to begin with. If we keep heading west from here, we'll eventually reach Mondstadt, the city of freedom. Yep, civilization. Mondstadt is the city of wind because they worship the god of animal. So perhaps because you got power from the god of animal, you can find some clues there. There are also lots of bards there, so perhaps one of them has heard news of your sister. Let's move then. The elements in this world responded to your prayers, and Paimon thinks that's a lovely sign. Interesting. Ooh. Yo, I'm too good already. Charge it. Oh my god. Elemental burst. These are the animal powers Holy. you got from the statue of the seven. Okay, okay. Oh, uh, Paimon's so jealous. Why doesn't Paimon get cool fighting powers? Press options to call Paimon and view the controls in the settings. Aha. Uh -huh. Okay, so chats to touchpad, that'll, be, that'll come in handy if I ever party up with some people. Switch party members, but... Aiming, so I guess you're going to be able to like, get bows or crossbows in this game. I just saw achievements. Just do anything. Oh, claim. Five Puma gems. Don't know what they do yet, but we move. I haven't got something here. I've got mail. Claim more. Okay. Well, I've got some pretty good stuff. Um. Okay, yeah, so I was right about food. Pointed feet. Uh, 
There's my guy. So it says I have mail. I already have the glider, I guess. I gotta remember, you have to let go of the right analog stick to actually access the menu. Check my stats. So I can level up. I'll go straight to 13, mate. 15, never mind. Jesus. I can already tell that this game's gonna be hella, hella in depth. I'm gonna use that sword, but you can enhance the gear. I don't know if I'm doing a good one. Well, my base attack 68. Apparently I have something in my profile. Let me just scroll all the way down on this. I don't know. But now I've got a big sword. Pick up this. Oh my god. There's something huge in the sky. How do I equip the glider? I don't know. That's it's headed cool. towards the heart of the forest. We must proceed with caution. Proceed with caution, eh? I think I have more stamina. I can't tell. Ooh. Huh? Hmm? Look at that. This is gonna be the drug. Yeah. <gasps> Oh my. Don't be afraid. She about to so right now. Oh, he that... about to get you. Is he talking to a dragon? Uh oh. <laughs> Who's there? He has six wings, what do you mean? Oh my god. He does not look friendly. Don't tell me I'm about to fight that thing. Okay, we're good. Whew, got scared for a second. I was about to fight a dragon. Nah. That was close. Paimon almost got blown away. Luckily, Paimon managed to grab hold of your hair. Thanks. <laughs> Just what was that? Paimon thought we were going to get eaten. Hmm. It definitely has something to do with that weirdo who was talking to the dragon. Yeah, Paimon gets why you're worried. Oh, what's that? There's that some kind of shiny red thingy on the big rock over there. That looks like a crystal. Let's go take a closer look. Be Dennis, careful, that's a good idea. Paimon doesn't have a good feeling about this. Trust me, you'll survive in a horror film if you have that mentality. Paimon's never seen a stone like this before, so Paimon can't tell what it is. All what Paimon knows is, is that it's crystal. dangerous. Yep. Best we put it away for now. Mm -hmm. Okay, we've got it. Now let's get out of here. 
And Paimon has a good mentality. She knows what's dangerous and what's not. Character XP. Oh, Arsley only switches the thing. I'm sorry, yeah, I just two combat. Absorb elemental orbs and elemental particles to replenish energy, dealing elemental damage to feed enemy enemies. Enemies or performing other actions might also generate elemental orbs. Okay. And that is a chest up there. Which I am going to get. A common chest. protect you stranger I am Amber outrider for the Knights of Favonius there we go you don't look like citizens of Mondstadt explain yourselves well, we're not looking for trouble that's what all the troublemakers say let's introduce doesn't ourselves. sound like a local name to me oh thanks and this mascot what's the deal with it <laughs> hey that's even worse than being a mascot so to sum it up, you're traveling partners, right? Well, look, there's been a large dragon sighted around Mondstadt recently. Best you get inside the city as soon as possible. It's not far from here. I'll escort you there. Oh, you don't really need aren't you out here for some other reason? In our sight. I am, but not to worry. I can keep you both safe while doing that too. Besides, I'm still not sure if I can trust you two just yet. Hmm. Oh, uh, I'm sorry. Probably not something I should say as a knight. I give you my apologies, uh, strange yet respectable travelers. That sounded so fake. <laughs> Do you have something against the type of language usage prescribed by the Knights of Havonius Handbook? You what? <laughs> Outrider Amber, report! Oh, damn. Oh. I missed. Okay. So, suspicious travelers, what are you doing in Mondstadt? He got separated from his sister during a really, really long... <laughs> oh, looking for your family? Huh. Uh... <laughs> Unlucky for me. Pretty much used all my things. Oh, never mind, I didn't. I don't need to check. What do I need to check? Weapons. I need to switch into this one. I have this. Level 4, level 11. Okay, let me finish my other stuff first, and then I can help you put up posters around the city. What exactly okay. is it you need to finish doing first? It's simple. You'll understand in a bit. Oh. Uh, a hilly churl. Teleport. Quick, get it! Uh oh. It's very sensitive, I must say. Power attacks can cause me to become affected by pyro when pyro meets other elements it often triggers an elemental reaction aim shots are great for making precision attacks on enemies weak spots tip for most human noise a for that. that's exactly what i did these monsters have been getting too close to the city recently hello Dan. Oh wow. Well, let's get this archer. Yeah. Oh wow. Okay. 
great to know that. with your moves there. Thanks for the backup. How'd it feel? Now that you mention it, how is it the hilly trails ended up here? These creatures don't seem like the type to set up camps so close to cities like this. Exactly. It's more normal for them to be much further out in the wilderness. But because the dragon, Storm Terror, has been around a lot more recently, destroyed, and the local market has been affected as well. When the storms hit, we usually end up with at least a few injuries, so the Knights of Favonius have been tied up doing the best they can to defend the area. So these annoying creatures have been getting closer and closer to the city? Exactly. That said, clearing this camp helped make the area a little bit safer. Come with me. A responsible knight must make sure to see you to the city safely. Well, let me get this chest first. Oh, an exquisite chest. Interesting. We get anything from this? What's this? Poem meets Dentro. Each other's burning, which continuously deals power damage until it wears off. So I'm guessing that's the way of saying Earth, not Earth, um, nature types. Travelers from around here as well? No, we just happen to be passing by. What are you cooking? Smells good! I see. Welcome, travelers. I'm Lynn, the survival expert of the Adventurer's Guild. As you can see, I'm experimenting with some new recipes. Eat before you go. The first rule in the Wilderness Survival Guide. Picnic? Oh, Paimon just loves picnics! My travel partner here is good at cooking as well. Mm, let's go That's this. okay. Let's see what you can do. You won't get a lot of chances like this to learn from a survival expert. There are some mushrooms and meat in the barrel over there. Try making a chicken mushroom skewer for me. Oh, God. Well, first of all, let's pick up this apple. Never go adventuring on an empty stomach. Why did I? <laughs> Is it done? Let me try. Hmm. Hmm. Uh. Uh oh. The seasoning is just right. Tastes pretty good. Paimon told you so. With your culinary skills, you should try more difficult dishes. Oh, I've got some raw ingredients in my bag. Have them in return for this meal. Can we really have them? Won't you run out of ingredients? That's okay. You should be able to find lots of ingredients when exploring the wilderness. Don't forget to look carefully. There's also a restaurant in Mondstadt known as Good Hunter that sells food and ingredients. Go have a look when you've got the time. Okay, thank you for the info. <gasps> hey, leave some chicken mushroom skewers for Paimon! Let's give it to Amber this time. Ooh. Let's do it again. Boom. Uh, let's do it for me now. Uh, 
too good. Jeez, hit those perfects. <laughs> Time to do. Jeez. Okay, um, I'll give one to Amber and then we'll start moving on. Jeez. Jeez, I need to cut me up a steak. Should probably not kill a bird in front of little Timmy over here. So this guy wants. Oh, <laughs> Jesus! My man said, what if they have never come back, <laughs> just like daddy? <laughs> no, no. <laughs> That's ridiculous. I am level 4. <laughs> oh my god. the protection of the Knights of Havonius, welcome to Mondstadt. Finally, no more having to camp outdoors. But the city folk don't look too cheery. Everyone's been put out of place by storm terror recently. But everything will turn out fine as long as Jean's with us. Jean? Acting Grand Master of the Knights of Havonius, Jean, Defender of Mondstadt. With Jean on our side, surely even the vicious Storm Terror will be no match for us. Before I take you guys to the Knights of Favonius headquarters, I have a present for you, Traveler. It's a reward for helping me clear out that Hillatrol camp. H hey! Why doesn't Paimon get a reward? Uh, because this reward is useless to you, Paimon. But I'll treat you to a traditional Mondstadt delicacy, Sticky Honey Roast. Sticky honey roast! Come with me. We'll head to the city's, uh, high ground. Oh, there we go. Finally have a little waypoint. <laughs> this used to be a bustling street, but with so many storm terror attacks recently, the Fame usual wait, crowds the are way. nowhere to be seen. How the hell do we get up? You know Except what? Except for the local tavern near the city wall over there. They well, haven't been affected. To do this anyway. If anything, their business oh. is better than ever. Wet environments and hydro attacks can cause beings to become affected by hydro. When hydro meets other elements, it often triggers an elemental reaction. Okay. So this sparkling thing is just the waypoint. Oh, I thought it was going to be smart. Okay, it looks like I need to get up there. <laughs> Easy collapse. So, the 
present I want to give you is a wind glider. <gasps> Outriders yes. use them to ride the wind, and the people of Mondstadt love using them too. I brought you here to give it to you so you can experience it right away. Oh, you're really excited about these wind gliders, huh? Well, that's because the wind is the heart and soul of Mondstadt. Oh. Alrighty then, enough talk. Let's give it a whirl. It's easy to use, but you still need to pay attention to my instructions. Oh my god. <laughs> oh damn. Dangerous, proceed carefully. Sit. Jeez. Yo, 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 yo. Thank you. Amber just got to level 3, I just saw it on the right. Oh. Storm's kicking in. The sky. I love the graphics. interesting because I was going to end the episode very shortly but I guess we're in the air so we're going to have to complete this part before we do anything else <laughs> huh? How are you staying okay. like this with just a wind glider? I'm preventing your fall with the power of a thousand winds now oh. concentrate see yourself grasping the wind harness its energy Yo. Yo. Okay, it's down to a half hour. Okay then, I think off stream I'm going to grind this game quite a bit, because this does seem like a grindy game as what most RPGs are to be honest, so yeah. Just a quick heads up in case I start a stream later on in this game and then I'm a lot more geared out than when the last stream ended on. And I'm also recording these streams, so I'm going to be able to make highlights of this. Uh, are you hurt? <gasps> You've oh actually got the power to go up against the dragon. Are you a new ally? Or a new storm? That is not all good. Storm 
Dream Terror is attacking Mondstadt itself! Kaya, Traveler, you've come at the right time. We must... Hold on, Amber. Are you perhaps forgetting to introduce us? Oh, right. This is Kaya, our cavalry captain. These two are travelers from afar. From afar? Is that all we know of them? Uh, long story short... I see. Welcome to Mondstadt. Uh, though you haven't arrived at the best of times, I'm afraid. I understand the anguish of being separated from family. I'm not really sure why you're looking for the Animo God. Oh, but everyone has their secrets, right? <laughs> Relax. I won't press you for more. First and foremost, on behalf of the Knights of Favonius, I would like to extend our thanks to you for your help just now. Your fight to defend the city against the dragon just now was witnessed by no small number of citizens. The acting Grand Master of the Knights of Favonius is also very interested in meeting you, and formally invites you both to our headquarters. <laughs> Jesus. Oh, what's that? A dressing room. Come on. These ones or the these ones look sick. Okay. This seems to be the Knights of Favonius headquarters. Let's head in. I am on the best travel companion ever, for God's sake. I feel like... Someone's been breaking the fourth wall here and put it themselves. It's a nice loading screen, to be fair. Jean, what's the hurry? I thought we agreed to meet them here. There have been sightings of storm terror outside the city. Once we meet, we must... Relax. I'll lend a hand when the time comes. Jean, I've brought them. <laughs> and once it was over, I brought them straight here. Mondstadt welcomes you, Windborn Travelers. I am Jean, acting Grand Master of the Knights of Favonius. This is Lisa, our resident librarian. <laughs> oh, are you sweeties here to help us out? <laughs> You're both so adorable. Sadly, the timing is regrettable. Storm Terror has caused quite a ruckus in the region since its recent resurgence. Simply put, Mondstadt's elemental sphere and ley lines are now akin to a yarn ball in the paws of a kitten. For a mage, it couldn't get much worse. My skin is one elemental particle away from a full-blown breakout. <sighs> if it weren't for this interference, the Knights of Favonius would have better ways to help you than just putting up missing person posters. We simply ask that you repose in Mondstadt while we help you seek out your sister. Too. Good. In that case, we need a plan. With Storm Terror now directly attacking Mondstadt, we may have an opportunity to cut this problem off at the source. Lisa has revealed the sources of Storm Terror's power with her detection magic. Is that so? They're located in the abandoned Four Winds Temples. 
Storm Terror's ability to whip up these kinds of storms can be attributed to it drawing power from the temples. Our objective is to deal with three of the four temples. I trust everyone understands why we are say? only dealing with three. Oh. Hyman doesn't. Knights of Favonius, time is against us. The storm is rampant. There is no point in maintaining a defensive position. All right. We need to take initiative and act before the situation escalates. Wish each has been a not wish upon the sky filled with a... Okay. Sharp, come on. One. What is the wish screen? Whoa. Wish times ten. Well, we're done. Oh god. Oh. Masterless Stardust. Pardon the thorn. A bow. Come on. Emerald orb. Sharpshooters oath. Again, a lot of masterless stardust. Whoa. Suit crows. Sick. Very interesting. So that's a new hero. What can she do? So she's a wind type. At least I think so. Um, interesting. Got a lot of swords and bows. Okay. I should have probably got that and then. <laughs> Okay, so use Primer Gems to do all of those things. Okay, and now Suit Close is part of my thing. Okay. So what's the weapons like? So she controls the Emerald Orbs. She literally has the same thing. Okay. Um, and then Hans. I wonder what refine does. Let me see what it does. Set material. Requires 500 gold. That should be alright. Refine. Rank 2. Let's go. Cool. Uh, select material. Okay. Uh, say enhance? God damn it. <laughs> Enhance. Yeah. So that's her done. Any artifacts? Nope. Several of them. Level seven. Okay. I need to level up my guy. Okay. Probably see the different weapons I have first. Okay. 
So I couldn't find all of I couldn't find these three swords. Max refinement level. Never mind. I'll say we go for the raven. Okay, I'm going to leave this episode here. I'm just going to grind off stream, level up, uh, upgrade everything, etc. Um, but yeah, as I said, I've recorded this gameplay so I'll be able to upload highlights when I can. And yeah, if you did like the stream, please like, subscribe if you're new. Um, according to statistics, only 50... 60% of my viewers aren't even subscribed, so click the subscribe button, it will really help out. And comment down below what you want me to do next, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Goodbye.